Hi, I'm Dr. Chloe Norcrup, and this is a panel about women in uniform. I was really drawn to see the different women who joined the auxiliary branches of the U.S. military during World War II. There was WAC, Women's Army Corps, SPARS, Women in the Coast Guard, there were Nurse Corps, there was WASP, Women Air Force Service Pilots, and there was WAVES, Women Accepted for Volunteer Emergency Services, and that was the auxiliary for the Navy. Now, I didn't find any examples of women in Johnson County who were WASP, but there were many, many who were members of WAC, SPARS, WAVES, and also were part of the Nurse Corps. We were really excited to be able to see as part of the collection some examples of the uniforms that women wore. This is an example of a Red Cross uniform, although not exactly connected then to auxiliary branches of the military, still incredibly important for women to be able to participate in really dangerous kind of work in World War II. And this, I think, is a reminder of that service. And then this uniform here is a WAC uniform, and we are so incredibly lucky to have such a pristine example of this uniform that women wore in World War II. I love that we have the jacket and the hat and behind we have the Wax Sisters from Cleburne and who are featured in an edition of Cleburne Times Review from September 19, 1943, showing just a few of the many women from Cleburne and from Johnson County who served in WAC and many of these other auxiliary branches in World War II.